Good day guys and uh, welcome back To those who are new to our channel Please don't forget to subscribe Okay, so this will be our uh, key single line diagram And by the way, our topic for today We will be discussing uh, Protection release setting for power transformer Okay, but uh, we will be discussing only uh, Three type of uh, release the ANSI 51 the 51N and ANSI 27 ok so let, uh, our subject transformer will be this uh, three transformers from here let's make this one uh, let's zoom in this one to make it uh, visible from our screen ok so the rating of the transformer is 4000 kVA ok and the primary voltage is 11 kV while the secondary voltage is 690 volts okay so um, let's open our uh, data sheet and other calculation sheets okay so This is our transformer rated 4000 kVA. Okay, so this is the name tag of the transformer since we have the three transformer here. Okay, this one. And this is uh, location where this is for bus bar A, bus, bus bar B, bus bar C. Okay, so from here uh, our relay the, our subject relay is uh, from G F60 uh, multilin the current transformer will be using the ratio of the current transformer ok will be 300 is to 1 ampere and the burden is uh, 10 VA and the class is class 5P20 ok our zero current transformer Okay, will be 25 is to 1 ampere. Our PT ratio is 11 kV is to 110 volts. Okay, so uh, our transformer rated current, okay, the, uh, it's 210 ampere. Our proposed cables, these cables from here, okay, these three cables are rated above 210 amperes okay the maximum in rush peak current this is useful when you're going later when you're going to mold uh, to check the time uh, dial multiplier will be 1225 amper at 0.1 second okay this is we have some uh, fault values from here there was this was taken after uh, the short circuit study the 11 kV minimum line to line fault is uh, 8,617 ampere our 11 kV minimum line to ground fault is above is around 422 ampere on the secondary side of the transformer on the 690 volt okay the maximum short circuit current as seen at 11 kV side is 3,880 ampere 690 volts minimum short circuit current is 1620 ampere okay time of tripping on the incomer side uh, incoming on the incoming of 690 volt is 400 milliseconds this breaker here this is will trip at 400 milliseconds okay and capacitive current this is for the cable is equal or less than 1 ampere so these are the uh, data for our uh, before we proceed to our proper calculation for our 400 kb transformer okay let's go to the page two okay so first uh, we will going to calculate the ANSI 51 or the time uh, phase over current relay uh, protection okay so we will having three uh, threshold from here okay and 
let's start calculating on the first threshold. Okay, this one. Okay, so for the first threshold, this is used. This is the back of, of the oil temperature and the DGP2 protections of the transformer. So this threshold is set at 115% of the rated current of the transformer. Our transformer rated current is 210 multiplied by 115%. Uh, That's why we have this uh, current pickup value of 241.5 ampere or 0 0.805 per unit at this 300 uh, is to 1 current ratio. Okay, so the curve that we will be adopting on our discussion today, we will be selecting I triple A very inverse. Okay? So, after calculating the first threshold, we have uh, that the setting for the TDM or time dial multipliers is 1.22. So, how is... So... We will discuss now how this 1.22 value has been arrived. Okay, so this is the equation, okay, for the for taking the time of the our I triple E very inverse uh, curve. Okay, so we have here the constant from I triple E standard. Th these are the constant, the A, B, and P. So substituting all this value to this equation okay and we we got this information okay but arriving this uh, arriving this answer to arrive this answer we have three conditions the first condition is it should allow transformer in rush current at 1225 ampere at 0.1 second okay so substituting the value of the uh, in rush current 1225 ampere this one and our in rush time this 0.1 second okay and these are the common values as per uh, ANSI standard and this okay and this is our pickup value which is 241.5 ampere so the total dial multiplier is 0 0.08 this is the first condition okay so our setting supposed supposed to be above the in rush current to ensure there will be no uh, unnecessary tripping okay okay then next the second condition it should be at least one second okay below transformer mechanical damage curve okay time dial is such that the proximity of the protection curve from the lowest point of the mechanical damage curve is more than one second and transformer is rated 40 kilo ampere at two seconds it seems here it's more than one second okay so that's why we substitute here two seconds it's saying more than one second minus one okay and we, we substitute this value this 40 uh, 40,000 amperes from here okay and the pickup value times the ratio of the primary voltage and the secondary voltage of the transformer okay so our the the after calculating this we have the dial, dial multiplier of is of equal to or less than 1.5 okay the next condition it should be coordinate with the secondary time over current relay at maximum through fault as seen by the primary over current relay okay so this discussion we will be assigning the uh, coordination time interval to be 200 milliseconds time of tripping on the camera on in camera 
incoming 690 volts and this is on the LB side which is 400 milliseconds so if we go on the first page this is one time of tripping on the incoming uh, breaker for our LB side would be 400 milliseconds so that's why we have this information here okay so so to we sum up this one that 0.2 second and 0.4 second that's why we have this information here okay and we use we use this 3880 because it is saying here time over current relay at maximum true fault as seen by the primary over current relay so 3880 this value as seen at 11 kb side we are using the maximum short circuit current okay so after our time dial multiplier on this equation is 1.22 second so this is the final uh, setting for our ANSI 51 or time over current protection uh, relay okay so hence TDM of 1.22 satisfies both in rest condition okay it should be above in rest uh, condition and transformer damage curve okay so this is the condition right now okay okay so this is time dial is equal to or less than 1.22 1.22 that's why we have this information from here okay so next uh, this is the first threshold and we will be calculating the second threshold okay the second threshold is saying this is a back off of the low voltage protection this threshold is set at 70% of the minimum short circuit current okay so our minimum short circuit current is 1623 ampere if we can go to this first page this one 1623 minimum short circuit current okay and multiply by 70 percent that's why we have this 1136.1 ampere or our second threshold setting we assign here 1134 ampere at 3.5 78 per unit this has taken when you're going to multiply uh, <clears throat> our current transformer ratio okay then with a definite time set at 0 0.7 seconds okay that is all for our second threshold our third threshold this threshold is set at 110 percent of the low voltage 690 volts maximum short circuit current okay so 110 percent times this is our maximum short circuit current okay the result is 4268 amperes we provided here 4200 the pickup current is 4260 amper at 14.2 per unit okay on our third threshold the our time setting the definite time setting is 0 0.1 second okay next relay will be the earth fault protection relay the 51n okay this threshold is set at 5% of the rated current of the transformer so the rated current of the transformer is 210 times 4 5% that's why our setting here is 10.5 ampere and it is equivalent to 0 0.42 per unit our zero current transformer rating is 25 is to 1 so that's why we have this information 0 0.42 per unit okay with a definite time set at 0 0.1 second okay okay so this will be our last relay for this transformer 
for this uh, calculation, okay? This is ANSI 27, the fish under voltage protection. Okay, so this threshold we are setting at 70% of the rated voltage on the primary side of the transformer. So, 0 0.7 multiplied by 11,000 volts. Our under voltage first threshold setting is 7,700 volts at 0 0.7 per unit. So, just multiply this one on our CT ratio with a definite time set at 3 seconds. Okay. So, thanks for watching. If you like our video, don't forget to like and share.